What's up, world? I am going to be doing this and um, painting today. So it's me. Hi. This is me without a with a beard and not having bathed in like years. That's my real skin. This is like no baths in years, right? Pretty good. Pretty good. I'm clean. I smell nice. You know what I mean. And it's like uh, I think of the. Uh, bathing thing it's sus it's not faddish it's a slave it's the slaves are dirty and you hate them so yeah it's funny i don't need it on video so i have like these new modes i'm not sure what this is when it swaps cameras or what it's like super weird right so anyway point six i want to get like Super close and accurate with detail, right? So it's like this. Does this work? Oh, it's a new camera now. Can you get super? Ooh, kind of. Oh, this is fun. Yeah, I started drawing as my escape in school. I would make these little tiny micro objects, and uh, I did. I always started drawing really, really, really small, and. Uh, yeah, I was I was this kid that like everyone wanted to take down, but they also copied. It was annoying. Yeah, jealousy will ruin your life. There's a saying in, for humans: it's like, <clears throat> be good but not too good, because to being too good can cost you. Because the people who went modest humble will feel left out, and they are. Yeah. Like, all the modest, humble breeders are just traitors. They don't believe in goodness. They're just saying, yeah, but my lonely, freaking horrible self deserves to exist more than everyone. Because me, you know what I mean? Yeah. It's all about me attitude is so toxic. That's why, like, we call the elite the elite. We know it subconsciously pisses everybody off. As soon as they hear the elite are elite, you know, like, these turds on Trash Planet, they think they're better than anyone here. Yeah, then they're not open to it. So, it, it is toxic. It's like, they mention the elite is like a poisoned word that they know. And you're not elite. If you go to the grocery store or you're circumcised, you're definitely not the elite. The elite live in a cave and do horrible things to kids all day. Yeah. It's the bunker lords. It's That's what Gears of War was about. Gears of War was about pedophiles. I just told you that. Yeah, the director told you that. The director is like, yeah, Gears of War is about pedophiles. It's a race of humans who separated long ago and live underground. So yeah, it's the mi that's why that's why they call children miners. They they belong to a miner. They belong to someone who lives under the earth. So yeah, circumcisions to make sure your wiener's small, so only the king has a big one. You think I'm playing? They did that worldwide to a billion people. This generation, the the survivors of it are living right now. So yeah. A lot of people have tried to force me into enthusiasm. I don't think it's honestly smart. Enthusiasm for Earth? The best part is, is it used to be hell and it's slightly better. The worst part is, is it's still fucking hell. And my whole existence is a fucking nightmare. I will never have a normal, good life ever. Mostly because of the creator, but also just because of the apes who live here, you know what I mean? So, yeah. Like how it closed itself, right?